Let's talk about troubleshooting a black screen on a monitor. This would be during an initial setup. Uh, first thing you do is you make sure that the power supply for the DVR is plugged into the DVR. Make sure that the monitor is plugged in and that it's turned on and that it's got power. Make sure you've got the HDMI cable plugged into the HDMI input on the DVR and on the monitor. And then make sure the DVR is turned on. Okay, now, if your monitor is set for 1080p, 1920 by 1080p resolution, the screen will come up and you'll see the DVR loading. If it's not set for that, what you're going to want to do, and you see, you'll see some type of signal that says input not supported. Then what you need to do is turn everything off, unplug the HDMI cable, and use a VGA cable from the DVR to the monitor. Okay? Plug that in, turn everything back on, and the monitor will come up with the screen. Now you can go into the DVR and tell it to use the other signal, the other port, um, the HDMI port, and then you can plug in the HDMI cable. Now, nine times out of ten, you won't have to do that if the monitor has been purchased in the last year or two, or the TV. It's the older ones that might only be 720p or have strange formats. And if it doesn't detect it, and you can't go into the monitor and change it to 1920 by 1080, then it's not going to work. Because that is high definition. There's three things you have to have for high definition. High definition recorder, high definition cable, high definition monitor. 1080p, 1080p, 1080p. Okay, and that's how you troubleshoot it. If you can't get a video signal on either one, the HDMI or the VGA, and you can't change the resolution on the monitor, it will not work. And we'll have you'll have to go get another monitor, and then we'll get it going.